Hello influencers, how are we doing? Good morning, good afternoon, good evening from wherever you're watching me. Welcome to another edition of No Host Bad with IT. My name is Itinu. How are we doing people? Good to see you. Good to be in the house today as usual. Okay, so I want to give you an update and I told you a few days ago that... <laughs> okay, let me just allow you to... <laughs> If you are, let me allow you to join this family. If you are seeing this channel for the first time, this is No Host Bad with IT. My name is Itunu. This is a channel where we say the way it is. No apology to any bagger. So, and uh, if you are returning subscribers, thank you so much. Mm, I love you like oh, no man's business. All right. So, uh, let me allow you, if you are seeing this channel for the first time, to join this family by clicking that red button and then let me know your comments in the comment section and share this video. Okay, so like, share, subscribe. Thank you so much for doing that. God bless you. So, I told you a few weeks few days ago, Faye Daniel's case was adjourned, I mean, was uh, put in hold, all right, last week because Justice Ramon Oshodi went for an official duty, so Justice is back and the case is back. So you remember, in case if you have not, um, if you don't, if you say, what are you talking about? I want to show you his photo, this is, um, this is a pastor. He says he's a pastor. Actually, he says he's a bishop in Nigeria, and he has been accused by some young ladies of um, telling them that God said he should have kind of knowledge of them, that God said he should sleep with them. If you watch this, if you watch my subsequent videos, and you will see I've done a lot uh, about this, uh, this case both on youtube and live <laughs> so uh there was even a testimony that um one of his victims gave that uh, they'll be having zoom meeting zoom fellowship they'll be having fellowship over zoom i'm going to post that video here uh and uh one of them will be doing blue job on the that's him he says he's a bishop and by the time he wants to ejaculate, we'll be speaking in tongues. <laughs> There's nothing we won't hear in Nigeria. And uh, people that are on Zoom would think that, oh, their bishop has, the spirit has touched their bishop. So that's the kind of person he is. I'm going to put the link to that video here. In case you've not seen it, I can see it again. So this is the kind of thing we we hear we see that has been testified uh, about him and uh so when some of some people come to my channel and they are writing some comment we're like okay pray you go to church right pray that what this ladies testify about what the experiences with the daniels were that we happen to your own daughters that's all don't come to my channel and say rubbish. I write rubbish. Just pray that this thing that no, no, okay. Let me let me frame the prayer because we go we all go to church, right? Pray that God will bring Faye Daniel's type across your daughters. Yes, I think it's better that way. Pray that God will bring Faye Daniel. Shebe is your bishop, is your papa, right? Pray that God bring the, the kind of this kind of man, this Faye Daniel, this your bishop, this your papa, because I don't want to call him mine. Pray that God will bring his type across your daughters. All right. So the case now, the uh, ID of the case is, um, the reference is ID uh, slash 21275C slash 23. You know, state versus that's the case, the number state versus Uluwafe, Europe with Daniels. Mm -hmm. So now the case is coming, is sitting, uh, is, is, uh, is being sat on by Justice Ramon Oshodi. 
I've done the profile on Justice Ramon Oshodi before. Let me quickly show you Faye, the last time he was in court. <laughs> Okay, so this is a man. I, 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 this is a man. Some of his um, cohorts, some of his, you see, ah, I, I don't know. If you saw my last video, I played a video of a guy who said he missed his flight. That was why he couldn't make it to his church in Abuja, you know, in May, wherein he's been detained. He is in Kikiri Maximum Prison, and he's still there. It's not that the court didn't really want to release him on bail, it couldn't meet the bail condition. And how much is this with all this, all this paparazzi? 20 million dollars, naira. 20 million naira. With shorty, he likes some, and the shorty is not half, not half house in Vegas. That's all. And so, because of that, he's still in Kirikiri, maximum prison. Okay, so <clears throat> the case now will be heard on Thursday. Today is Wednesday, that's tomorrow. Yes, so uh, don't support your bishop, please. Uh, give this video a thumbs up <laughs> and let me know your comments. All right, so don't just support your bishop on, on YouTube, go to court and support and support him. He, he will be appearing at the at uh, the court in the Keja Lagos. Thank you so much. I'm going to be giving you updates, and I told you we hear the updates on Faye first on this channel. So when uh, justice see tomorrow, one of the victims will be in court. Mm -hmm. You see, this guy picked his victims from remote areas, and young girls as uh, as uh, young as 19, 20, and he made them pastors, assist assistant pastors. He put a Big titles on them so that they will feel, you know, so that they will have this um, spiritual jib jib jib. <laughs> so, people, please, no matter how young you are, read your Bible because um, we're not blaming them because it's, it's hard. The kind of gymnasium those people do, these pastors do, the kind of thing they, the, the kind of thing they do. The kind of lies they tell, you know, it's um. For instance, this one of the victims said, the first time he made her to undress, and he was like, okay, wear your clothes back. I, I just want to test your loyalty. How do you test somebody's loyalty by telling the person to undress? And then he came out again into the room into the room, get undressed again and began to, you know, to have kind of knowledge of I loved a lot. You, you've heard a lot about it. You've seen videos about it. You've heard, you've read about it. So when we discuss things like this and some people still think that, uh, blah, 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 blah. So please, your only prayer will be, if you like this face so much, your only prayer will be God bring this type of person across your daughters that's all so tomorrow thursday 12th october you will be appearing in courts again i want to say a big thank you to justice uh, ramon Oshuri, like i always do on this channel at, at a point when judges went on on recess this man did not go because of he was sitting because of this um of a user case his lawyers, he kept changing lawyers. That was that's what is even delaying this case. So he kept changing lawyers. Uh, I think it, at the time his brother is, I think his brother is still sitting. I mean, uh, uh, appearing for him. You know, I raised the question here that okay, can somebody's somebody's brother be his lawyer? And I think a, a viewer replied that yes, he can. Okay, so if he kept changing his own lawyers, <laughs> that's part of the thing that's, uh, that has been delaying this case. And then the new lawyer will come to court like blank. He doesn't even know much about what is happening. A particular lawyer dropped the case when he heard testimonies of these victims. Yes, you heard me right. He was like, oh, I have daughters. I don't want this kind of thing to happen to my daughters. 
he wash his hands of the case. Go and give your job to another person. Those are those are lawyers that have conscience. Those are lawyers that doesn't. It's not about the money alone. Yeah. So that's why I say, if you think Feyi is your bishop, is your pastor, just pray. Bring this kind of my pastor across <clears throat> my daughters. That's that's the only thing you need to do. Don't come to my channel and I like rubbish. All right, people, I'm going to. <laughs> I'm going to keep you updated. Um, yes, thank you so much. I'll see you very soon. I always say it on this channel. Go to church with your brains intact. Don't leave your brains at home and go to church. All right? Uh, yeah. Check what, whatever your papa, your pastor, whatever, whatever you call them. Check what they are saying. You read the Bible. Check I mean, just oppose whatever you hear with what is in the scripture. Even morally, if, if you don't even know the Bible, morally is it even right for somebody who has a wife somewhere to be sleeping with you, his member? Think about it in a moral way. And please, you are not tied down to that church. Yes, forget. See, let me tell you this. There's, there's, there, there's something Nigerian pastors do. Some of them. Don't let me be... Um, uh, don't let me generalize. Some of them, they say, uh, if you leave this ministry, I will curse you. It's a lie. It's a lie. Nobody can curse anybody. There's no curseless curse. Read your Bible. Let, look, I've said it a lot of time. We are all the same in God's eyes. God doesn't have grandchildren. Mm -mm. You only have children. You are his child. Don't let anybody think he or she is the intermediary between you and God. No. God doesn't see. These titles, uh, bishop, pastor, apostle, it is just for the sake of administration. That they can, okay, I'm the head. They are the head of this church. That's all. It's their church. So they are the head. So don't think they are more highly placed in the, in the sight of God than you. Read your Bible. Alright? God is is no respecter of any person. He said, draw nigh unto me, and I will draw nigh unto you. So, your closeness with God depends on you. <laughs> How close you are to God is a function of you, you. How you relate with Him. So, if you don't draw to Him, He will not draw to you. I always say something that you cannot ask uh, your child cannot go to your next door neighbor and say, uh, uh, give me my school fees. Your neighbor will ask, I want your father. Yes, so he is your father. There is no intermediary between you and him. Just give your life to him. Serve him. That's all. And he will relate with you. So don't see somebody as, um, as a go in between. Go between, between, yeah. Go between, between you and God. Okay. Go between, go between. <laughs> Relatively, talk to God yourself. I'm not saying don't fellowship in a place, but if you are in a place and you see that you're in a church and you see that this thing, things that I'm doing here doesn't um, resonate with my spirit, leave. Nobody can curse you. Nobody is a lie. They, they, you know, they say that in order to to create fear in your heart. The only, the only place where that works is in the kingdom of darkness. In the kingdom of darkness, they, ha they have hierarchy, all right? And they are sworn to the blood covenant they swear to that, okay, if you did this, this is it, because they don't know Christ. But with God, with Christ, you are the same. There is no title in heaven, no pastor. God, does, God doesn't refer to anybody as pastor. Trust me, does it? He referred to people with their name. If he talked to you forever, somebody, and the person is a pastor, he said, this person, not pastor. There's no pastor in heaven. There's no apostle in heaven. There's no bishop in heaven. All these earthly titles. What am I saying? Don't see anybody as being closer to God than you. If you see what some of these people are doing, they are closer, you'll be shocked. We are talking about one now, for Daniels. Mm-hmm. Okay, people. Is she preaching? No, I'm not preaching. <laughs> I just want to. 
I just want you, you know, to open your mind up to some of this thing. Open your mind, okay? You see, when we talk about things that has to do with judge, that has to be do you with uh, Christianity, you you get you get churchy, you get religious, all right? Yeah, it, it doesn't really Christianity is a way of life, all right. So thank you, people. I'm going to come your way again very soon. Give you updates, and um, I'll be just to you. All right, take care of yourself. I love you. Go to church with your brains intact. Don't leave your brains at home and go to church. <laughs> bye bye. I love you.